It's incredible to think where I first saw Kelty play. It was with no fans at Cumberland Old Colts in a Lowland League game. And then like a week or two later, I saw them again in a behind closed doors game against Gala Feridine Rovers again in the Lowland League. And that was, yeah, well over a year ago now when we were in the midst of all the lockdowns. But today I get to see Kelty lift the League 2 trophy, a hugely historic day in their history. Like I say, I saw them at first in a couple of Lowland League games, then they invited me down for a couple of Lowland League games at their stadium with no fans, and then uh, eventually I've got to see them with fans. Um, I got to see their uh, Highland slash Lowland playoff win against Brora. I got to see their first SPFL game of the the history that was this season against Cowden Beef, the Fife Derby. I've also seen them play numerous times in League Two this season, but today is just massive. I get to see them lift a trophy, and I could not be happier. Please do hit that like button. Please do subscribe if you're new. Before we go down to Kelty, I have something very important to buy. I've never thought to do this, but yeah, since Kelty is such a favourite of mine, I guess you could say. I've got myself a Sharpie, well, a couple of Sharpies, you can't buy them in ones I don't think. Um, so I've got a couple of Sharpies, I'm going to buy a shirt when I'm there, um, and I'm going to get the players to sign it. And as you can see, we are back where I belong, the home of Kelty Hearts. It really is a uh, home from home for me. Uh, they've always made me feel very, very welcome. So to be here today is absolutely massive. And I just want to say a huge thank you to Fanbase for sponsoring this video. Not only can you as a fan buy tickets through Fanbase to come and see football at football clubs like Kelty Hearts, um, but Fanbase also help Kelty and other teams in numerous different ways. Match day operations have been simplified uh, to save time and can allow staff to focus on other tasks that can increase revenue at the club. Kelty uh, by going digital for the St Johnston game in the Scottish Cup, they allowed staff to focus on other aspects of match operations rather than just the ticketing side of things. Just sum up how the season has gone and sort of what today means. Brilliant, a chance to celebrate. All the achievements of the season. Eh? I think of course. Last came from non-league football. Yep. Like, of course, that's what I was going to ask you next was like, how does it feel to obviously go from the Junior Leagues, the Lowland League, East of Scotland League, and now, of course, winning this league. How far can Kelty go? Championship. Championship? Not the Prem? If our broke can get that close? Ten years. Ten years, you reckon, will be in the Prem? Champions League, ten years. Of course, of course. Champions League winners in about 12, I'd say. So what do you reckon the score's going to be? I'll start over here. I think it'll be 3 0 Kelty. 3 0. 5-0. Uh, 5-0, five nil. Five nil, wow, huge. 3-0. 0-0. 2-0. 3-0. 3-0. Going to be a good occasion, isn't it, today? So what do you think the score's going to be? 2-0. Uh, and? 2-0. Legends, lads. Score prediction? 2-1. Two, 2-1. One. Two, one. Two, one. Uh, one, no one nil. 2-1 two, one, all going for two, wins. 2-1. 2-1. 2-1. 2-0 kill. 2-0. Enjoy. Big day today, isn't it? Yeah. Score prediction? 2-0 uh, kill. Legend, mate. Enjoy. DJ. Mate, it's great to finally have you uh, on the videos. Um, you've made some massive saves this season. Yeah, I've made a few saves. Um, I've made the Kelty Hearts game last week. Yeah. Um, and I've made the Kelty Hearts game this week. Yeah. Um, I've made the Kelty Hearts game this week. I know the game here against St Johnston was massive for you personally. You made some incredible saves. That was a cup game. Yeah. But just how well has the season gone in general for yourself and for Kelty? Oh, amazing. Um, got a cup run. I ended up getting a good cup run, actually. Um, disappointing in the, the cup game, the snow, obviously, got the Premiership teams in it. Yep. St Mirren B actually played really well that night, till getting them the Um And then we've won the league. I think the, the accomplishments that we've, or the achievements that we've managed to pick for the season has been perfect for us. Yeah. That's what we wanted. And so for next season, then, League One, of course. Is imminent. How do you think Kelty would get on oh, in that league? I knew you were going to ask. I don't know. <laughs> I'm glad we're close. That's a good start. They were. Did they finish third? Yeah, they're up there. So yeah. if they're up there and in the playoffs and stuff like that, that's sort of where we would like to be as well next year. So Perfect. if we manage to compete with them, 
hopefully if we bring in a few extra bodies and whatever, we manage to compete again next year, that'd be brilliant. 2-1. And you, what do you think? I think it's going to be 1-0. One 1-0, one so not many goals, not many goals, what do you think? Um, yeah, I'm always so appreciative of how Kelty have treated me down the years, um, which is why I always um, love to come back and cover them so much. Even just like when there was no fans and that, they would um, obviously let me in. As I've touched on in this video, and the regular viewers will know, but yeah, I don't obviously usually do this, but I've obviously bought a shirt for today. As you would have seen from earlier on, I already have one signature. That is the signature of DJ, who I would have shown you, the goalkeeper here um, at Kelty Hearts, who has had an incredible season. He really has. So have all the rest of the team. Um, three Kelty players, I believe, are nominated for player of the year um, I want to say so yeah they've had obviously an incredible season they won the league they wrapped it up weeks ago um, but today's the day they get their trophy and I'm trying to get myself a souvenir by buying a shirt and getting all the players to sign it of course I got that sharpie earlier so an absolute honour to be here to meet some of the players to chat to the fans as per usual um, but on the pitch right now awaiting kickoff People will recognise you from the last couple of Forfa videos. Mate, you were the star of the show the last time Kelty played Forfa. I was there yep. at your stadium. And we won 2 1, I think. It was. was it 1 0? Oh, yeah, 1 0. I think it was 1 0, yeah. Seven, and it was a wild celebration, it wasn't it? Yes. And so, how has the season gone in general for Forfa? Ups and downs, but. Mainly ups. You've been doing yeah. okay. Still confident you go up through the playoffs? I think so, yeah. And score prediction for today? 3 1 Kelty, but. I want it to be 2-0 for a 2-0 Kelly! 2-0 mate, enjoy! 2-0 Kelly! 2-0! 2-0 Kelly! 2-0! We're going for 2 nils. <laughs> So score prediction for today, what do you reckon? Score for today? Good mate, good, looking forward to today. Score prediction? Mate, enjoy, it's good to see you again. How's it going, you okay? Come on, mate. It's fast. 3-2, he's going for goals. 2-1 Two one. I thought signatures ended when phones came out. Smartphones. Hang on. Hey, I'll fella. Score prediction. Enjoy. Oh, it's going to be a guard of honour. Guard of honour. Yeah, nice, nice. Well done, boys. Oh, Kelty! Yay! Kelty, Kelty,
You're a Kelty slash Rangers fan, right? Yeah. So a good season here, but not so much at <laughs> Ibrox, right? Nah, but I'm excited for the Europa League, of course. Yeah, of course, but excited for the trophy lift a bit later. Yeah. Final score prediction. Um, Perfect, mate. Enjoy. Legend. Cheers, Top man. Yeah. Score. Yeah. What do you think the score is going to be today? Yeah, 2-1 Kelly. 2-1 on Kelly, mate. Enjoy, enjoy. There you go. Look at him on the wall, Ed. He's the best drummer. You don't want me on the drums. I'm no good. I'm no good. Coach can, mate. Coach can. Enjoying the game so far? How's the atmosphere been? And what's the final score going to be? 3-0. You reckon it'll be 3-0? What do you think it'll be? 2-0? Here we go. Plates coming off. First half is over. It's 1-0. 2. Can we see you in the second half? I thought 4 4 were going to win. Nah. But it's 1 0. It's 1 0. You thought they were going to win, or? Yeah, I thought Kelty was, was going to be 2 1. But looking forward, looking forward to seeing them lift the trophy, though, yeah? Yeah. Nice. Go on, Kelty. Hi, guys. Kelty! Here comes the, uh, the podium for the trophy. I've made it pitch side. be here look on the pitch I know we always say it's an honor to be here there and everywhere but it really is like to be here at Kelty and to um, see the turnout here today for everyone winning one league two and the uh, times that I followed Kelty from Cumbernet Old Colts and uh, Gala Ferry Dean Robes in the Lola League with no fans when Dylan Easton was still here and uh, changing managers from Barry Ferguson to Kevin Thompson and then uh, all the way to where we are now where uh, Kelty are about to lift the league two title as you can see over there there is the podium here are the fans they are gonna love this here we go here comes the trophy Wow, look at this. Here come the players. A few of them got beers in hand. Check this out. Here come the lads.
obviously a massive day. How does it feel today to celebrate? Um, how does it feel today to celebrate after last year? Because you didn't get to celebrate really with the fans, did you? Yeah, it was good. It's good. It's good. Obviously, these moments don't come around too often, you know. I've been playing football professionally now for ten years, and this is only the second time it's happened. So yeah, yeah, it's good. It's magic, and uh, it's good the fans come on, get the pictures and stuff. So yeah, of it's been course, a really good season. So and how many yeah. goals has it been for you this season? Just a 21, I think. Just a 21. Yeah, I've struggled a little bit towards the end there with a few injuries and stuff. Yeah. No, I've contributed enough to the team and uh, helped uh, help with some some big goals. And, Absolutely, yeah. Um, yeah, it's been good. And so League One next season, confident you can go up again? Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, first game we win. Yes, I think so too. I'll see you there at that very game, mate. All the best, boys. Good luck, yeah? Bye. If my support of Kelty has been leading up to anything, it has been uh, leading up to them lifting a trophy and me actually being there to witness it. They lift a lot of trophies. They've had a lot of success over the past few years, um, but due to um, the obvious reason, um, I wasn't able to see them um, actually get promoted last season when they played in the uh, the playoff against Brecon, um, which was a real shame. I was gutted to have missed out. I was here for the Brora one. Um, then I was away when they played Brecon and I couldn't go to the Brecon game. They wouldn't let we come at Brecon, that's the people at Brecon. Um, but Kelty have always been so, so open and welcoming to me. And then I come along for a game like today. I've visited Kelty a lot. I've been home and away to see them play. And now to see them play a game like today, to meet all the players on the pitch at the end, have a proper chat to them. I've met a few of them, like in bits here and there, interviewed a few of them before, but to actually like just stand and have a chat with um, the Ross Philps and the DJs of this world and Cardo and other players and stuff. Fash was absolutely brilliant. And a load of them have signed my shirt as well. Look, I'll get it out oh, for the outro. Look at that, I've got some signatures on there. Tidza, the captain, I think Joe Cardo, Fash, as well as a few others. DJ, like I say as well, so absolutely buzzing that I've got this shirt. Kelty are an amazing club. I get messages from people all the time saying, never even been to Scotland before, I'm from England or whatever, but I'm going to Scotland to see Kelty. If you haven't been to see Kelty, if you're from Scotland or whatever, then come and see and play. And remember, fan base, top link in the description box below. If you want to get tickets, then uh, then download the app. What a day this has been. Probably my favourite video I've ever had the pleasure of filming. Do hit that like button. Do subscribe if you're new as well. I'll leave some videos on screen. Please do click on to carry on watching. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next one.